Okay. Um, do you think math is important in everyday life? Yeah. Um, you might not use it in a technical sense. Uh, I guess anybody who's not, anybody who's going into a science type of field will definitely use math a lot. And so for them, yes, it's very important um, as a career. Um, and But the, even just in everyday life, for those people and for non-science people, um, you would need to use math for any kind of finances. Um, we have, like we have to take a finance type class, for, even for mechanical engineering curriculum. Um, we have to do a finite class, or a, sorry, a finance class and a economics class, and so you use math for those. Um, and that's just general living life. Um, you have to pay bills, and so you have to be able to at least do addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, all that um, is very important. And there's other stuff that you can use in order to do that stuff way easier than just adding and multiplying and stuff. Um, and then, I mean, I guess for cooking, um, is also just using, be, being quick at math will make you can make your job a lot easier. Make cooking anything, yeah, mixing ingredients, um, multiplying if you want to make twice as much as what the recipe calls for, I don't know. Um, so I'd say there's still a lot of practical applications for math in the everyday life, um, even if you don't think of yourself as doing math, um, you would still use it to an extent. Uh, how do you think math has impacted society and technology of today's world? Um, probably a lot of impact has been caused by math. Um, I mean, really, any, any like non-ethical, philosophical progress um, is probably mostly driven by math. Um, so Da Vinci and um, anybody doing structures, building buildings, um, and any kind of technology would, real, would probably, the foundation would be math. Um, so really, I guess, all progress. <laughs> all non-ethical progress uh, is probably directly driven by math. So it's important, kids. <laughs> Alright, my last question is, uh, what advice would you give to someone who does not do well in math? Um, probably either if you, if you like it, then keep going. Don't give up. Never give up, never surrender. Tim Allen told me that on Galaxy Quest. Um, and if you don't, then maybe choose a different route. <laughs> um, but, like I said in the previous question, the, you'll still need to use math on a regular basis, at, at least the bottom fundamentals of math, um, to do a lot of um, just normal, everyday life stuff. Um, so, Definitely have the fundamentals down. If you're not doing great in calculus or pre-cal or whatever, then I mean you don't have to give up because it. Yeah, you would just you would learn it. I don't know why I'm going with this. <laughs> <laughs> it's important. Stay in school. <laughs> okay. There you go. So, in the powers. So, that'll be it. Oh, this way, it's fine, this way. <laughs>